before we use the range finder on the Geo7X, it's always best to make sure that the range finder module firmware is up to date as well as the range finder utility software that's on the Geo7X. So let's pull that up and take a quick look. So we'll just click on the start button. Scroll up here, click on settings, system. Scroll all the way up to system information. And right there is where we'll see the firmware version is 1.005. So now let's make sure that that's the most current one. You can always look at the compatibility chart. Or what I think is best is always to just go periodically and check on Trimble.com uh, and make sure. So let's just back out of here and we'll just, just go to Trimble.com. Support and training, support A to Z list, the letter G for the Geo, Geo7. Technical support. And now you'll see that all the various information that's available for you there on the tech support tab. Go to downloads, Geo7 downloads, and here's where you'll find that information the rangefinder utility and the rangefinder module firmware. That's what we was just looking at. And the most current one is 1.005, so we're, we're good. If yours is not, you can just click on this and save that installer to your computer. Uh, and then just follow the instructions that's included there with it and apply that. You just copy the... Uh, it's got the instructions right here. Copy the executable to your 7x uh, and then run it. Uh, the way you would copy that, you would just connect with Windows Mobile Device Center, uh, go into the File Explorer and drag it over there. Next thing to verify is the rangefinder utility itself. So let's take a look at that. So you click on the start button and then just crank up the rangefinder utility and go to settings. Scroll this page all the way up to about 1.21.5. Dot five eight seven eight. Okay. Let's go back here to downloads. This is the full installation. So if yours does not have it at all, this is where you would get it. Uh, so one dot two one dot five dot five eight seven eight is the most current one. Uh, there's. Uh, release notes uh, that will walk you through the install on that. 